back to Random and Proud. I'm Renee. Josephine's picking up a container that the wind was blowing across from people fishing here. After I have a little message for everybody. I think we should maybe stop polluting, you know, our territory. If you want to say that. Because, you know, we, we, we should, you know, keep it clean and at least everybody is able to be fish and real fishing, magnet fishing, whatever. If we keep doing this, they're going to close everything. And now I understand why they everything is private. Because, because people are dirty. People don't give a fuck. True. There's a lot of places you can't fish anymore. And that's the reason why. I was told that's the reason why. Uh, from a lot of these people, you know. Um, because I inquired, like, you know, there's nowhere to go fishing anymore and stuff like that. Like, there's very little spots and, you know, nice days like today, it's packed, man. Like, there's people everywhere, you know? And they said... There's more over there. Yeah. Like, it, it's just everywhere. It's so heavy to carry. So, it's, it's, it's not just magnet fishing, it's regular fishing, too. But I started by picking up more nails and screws same place people I had a video before where I've cleaned up at least three four times here from magnet fishers okay and I'm doing it again today and eventually somebody's gonna get a nail in their tire get into a bad accident and it's gonna be done no more magnet fishing no more nothing smarten the fuck up pardon my language but you're a goofball you're a loser and uh, you're doing it for the wrong reasons if you're gonna let it stick to your magnet, put it in the goddamn bucket is where it belongs. Not that don't take it off the magnet and throw it back in the water, because I see a lot of you do that too. <laughs> That's funny by the way. Message Joe, we're cleaning the waters and everything. Yeah. Cleaning the waters means you're gonna put it in the bucket and Does you're gonna Does that look get like it's cleaning it. the water? Does that look like it's cleaning the water? Yeah, where do you think that is gonna go? Back it's in not the us, water? we just got here. That's dry as fuck. But anyway, sorry. <laughs> sorry, I do sound a little, a little too upset. Yeah, sorry, but uh, when you keep coming to a spot that you got to constantly clean, yeah. not out the water, but, you know, things move whatever throughout the years. I'm sure if we cross, if you cross and you, and you beat on that plastic from, from oh, yeah. last weekend containers was packed here. and, and yeah. uh, uh, lures containers. Packaging. Yeah, uh, those ones that go out to the to the store and buy their tackle. They're, oh well, you know today. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm just gonna buy all the shit and then throw everything everywhere. Get it caught. This and that. Last time I was here, they had uh, their whole lunch bags. What was it, Burger King or some shit? Oh, look at this. Dead turtle. Poor thing. Like, why would you put a rock here? You want somebody's tire to hit that? Look. Toss, toss that rock was right here. Sorry, I thought the camera was around. Look at this. Don't worry, I'll pick up your garbage. Rubber. Rubber's not part of nature. Don't worry, I'll pick that up. Yeah, I'll pick up your water bottle. Oh, let me see your bag. Oh, look at look at all your worm containers and, and bottles everywhere. A rag. Look like smashed plastic or glass. You know, when I started magnet fishing, you know what, I, I was an idiot. I literally thought that living in Canada, I'm not going to find much. I'm not going to find much garbage to clean. Yep. Unbelievable. I don't mean to be shaming, but I mean to be shaming. You're a loser, and you're lazy. You think you're out here getting exercise, doing this shit, leaving all this fucking garbage around for everybody else? 
for nature. You disgust me. It just disgusts me. The problem is somebody should do some lessons, maybe in school, you know, and, and teach them how long it takes. Why would they teach them that in school? They're too busy teaching things they don't use. Well, you know, how many how many how many people have you dated that don't know how to cook? <laughs> huh? <laughs> or how to do laundry? You know? <laughs> I can't. I just can't. I'm just gonna shut up and uh, mind my business, clean up this fucking mess that I didn't make, and get on to magnet fishing. What the hell, man? <laughs> I think they literally, like, drop pails and pails of nails just to throw them in the water and get oh, rid of them. I don't know. It's weird. Reminds me of Hellraiser's head. <laughs> See where they belong? We're going to do a lesson here. Do you see? These are screws and nails. That's a bucket. Or a pail, whatever you want to call it. That's where they go. They don't belong on the road. Right here. For people to drive on. Because I already got one in my tire and I'm assuming this is where it freaking came from. Right there is full. Right there. So you really think they took a bucket and fucking dropped them? Oh, yeah, I'd say. Yeah, look at all the bubbles. Oh my god. What the hell? You've got a branch. It's a damn branch. I thought, geez, there can't be something big still in here. <laughs> I haven't cleaned this thing out yet. That's another thing. These people come, uh, like, oh yeah, I'm going to buy a magnet. I'm going to go magnet fishing. And they think that they're going to get more than nails, screws, and little things. They think they're going to come out here and they're going to get something real big and heavy. And No, you're not. <laughs> you're not going to get that with your $100 magnet. I'm sorry. You have to spend the money on a good magnet to get shit like that. There's a way to another hook. Oh, yeah, it's just those snap-on weights. It's not ones that go on the leader. Mm -hmm. I'll throw it. Go ahead. See? Pull this hook out in the line. That's where it belongs. For what? Oh. You didn't hit me. No. Nope. Okay. She wasn't getting any of it. Can't even talk. She wasn't getting anything on the other side anymore. So we decided to move to the other side. This is the side most of the people have been fishing on. Anyways, so. Well, we can get some lures and stuff. Oh, what was that? You scared something. Me either. Either a fish or a turtle, probably. And I didn't get screwed, I got riveted. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Riveted!
Look at the way that landed. Like it landed on something. Yeah, I did. Nope, came off. Oh, there's something there. Oh, there's something big there. Ugh! That popped off. Must be part of the old bridge, I think. No. I'll never get whatever that is. That seems like it's part of the old bridge or a car or something because that ain't coming. <sighs> a pin to something. That's a drill bit. Oh yeah, we should probably give him a shout out, eh? <laughs> Mike. <laughs> shout out to Mike Bazaar, who showed up and uh, said, oh, how'd you guys do? Well, we hadn't started yet. Everything kind of fell over in the back and there was a huge mess because we had pails of metal in there and well, that was fun to clean up. But he didn't, he didn't stick around. He was going for, what, what do they call that up north? A rip. He was going for a rip <laughs> with his dirt bike. So... He wished us luck, we wished him luck, and here we are. Mike, come out next time and stay a while. Take a couple throws. I feel like I might have attached to something. Nope. Must have turned over a rock. Come on, nobody lost any lures? Oh. No, but somebody from magnet fishing had a screw. But uh, my rope just pushed along. Oh, um, oh yeah, <laughs> I thought I did, felt like I did. Didn't it look like I did too? Yeah. Not how much work in it. We have. Change that. <laughs> and there we are. Yeah, not bad. That's a cool looking one. Been down there a while. Oh, can you guys see that? Different, eh? That thing spins right there. There we are. Maybe that's what I felt. Probably pulled it off or something. Lots of traffic. How's my pants? Good. Pants are falling down. 
Get sued for blinding people with my white ass. <laughs> I won't blind you with it, but y'all can kiss it. Right down the middle. That's it. Water's moving. It's like, it, I think it, what happens here is it gets sucked out and then it gets pushed back in. Do you think so? Oh, yeah! Cha-ching! Well, not a cha-ching, but... <laughs> Another winner winner. What kind of look at the hook they were what were they doing with the with that hook there? What the I think we got here. Crikey's? That's garbage man. No it's not, it's just muddy. Wait. I'm not talking about the hook and shit. But I'll deal with it later. I'm not sure what that springy thing is for though. Never use the springy thing. And of course, we nailed it. Right down the center, too. If nobody's coming, let's give her. See how I can do. Let's go to the middle. Ready? I don't know if we're going to go any faster, but. No, didn't get any more distance than what I had. <laughs> oh well. I tried, right? Listen, I'm going to be 46 years old. And I do this shit. So, I think I'm doing pretty good now. <laughs> I don't got my looks, but I'm saying my sanity is alright. <laughs> I'm still strong. Tad bit overweight, but I'm strong. Oh, oh, that maybe that did move. Maybe you should get the 20, 2400 pounds. Take over. I think we're turning rocks, but 
my hands are sweating. These gloves are a little tight. I gotta go a size bigger. You just never know. But they keep you dry and they keep you warm in the winter. So, can't complain. Anything? Yeah, you got something on there. got the bins over here but you got a lot of nails and uh, a treble hook well, that's kind of weird why would they put a treble hook on there like that oh maybe they had a piece of wiener oh maybe they used a piece of wiener to fish with oh shit watch your fingers not good do not get between the magnet and metal with your fingers. That would be a big no-no. Okay, this is going to go in the garbage. That, that hook is good, so we're going to keep it. Because I do need one for a lure I found. What you got? Hmm. Weird shape for sure. <laughs> Again, Kratos power. Don't stand up there, bitch. Well, I wish you could get paid for it, but that won't happen, unfortunately. People get into this for money. <laughs> the joke's on them. Oh no, we got company. Curious being? Mm -hmm. Curious beings? Or fishing? Oh. Fishing. Right where we're throwing. Can you believe it? Is that something? What is it? A bolt. A bolt with a washer. Show it one more time. Person. <laughs> Same technique. <laughs> <laughs> Same ginormous hook. <laughs> you want to take that? <laughs> the ginormous railroad spike. Deer. Look at the beauty.
an old car or something. nails and screws and rivets and I'm done because I need a shower I'm sweating I got those white fuzzy things I got nowhere to <laughs> yeah. this is for everybody that wanted to see Renee in action <laughs> wants to see my ugly face. Get out of here. I'm not going to get any writing that way. Yeah, sure. Peace. Anyways, that's it for this one. Sorry you had to see me in all my glory. I'm tired. One day off. I gotta work tomorrow. Tired. My hat's crooked. I need a tea. Shower. I worked out for this donut that I'm going to have tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. We really appreciate the support. Um, look how far we've come. It's pretty crazy. Uh, and by the way, celebrating 500 uh, <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we have 500 today. Let's hope it sticks. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty uh, blown away. Blown away. Pretty humble about that. Honestly, when I started this, I thought like maybe 10 people. I'll have 10 people and it'll be my very best friends and family. Well, a lot of my very best friends probably don't even watch me, probably aren't even subscribed. Um, yeah, and a lot of my family don't watch either, I'm sure. So I know my brother does and uh, I appreciate that, bro. And, uh, yeah, my brother's mother-in-law actually watches us faithfully. <laughs> I really appreciate that. I gave her a t-shirt as a thank you. And, uh, it doesn't go unnoticed. It does not go unnoticed. I notice everything. I, I, 
I see every comment. If I don't see it and I've missed it, I end up finding it and seeing it. And uh, I usually always comment back. I do my best. Um, like I said, I do a lot. I do all the editing myself, the videoing. That's why you don't see me very often. I do all the posting and I work full time and try and keep everybody happy. So, doing stuff around the house too. You got your everyday life. It's a lot. So if you know anybody that does this, bear with them too. Be patient with them too because you don't realize how much work this is and how tiring it is. And, uh, you know, I do it for memories, for the family, for the kids, and uh, for the environment. It's a good thing to do. And this is afternoon. Yeah, this is just Three, whatever. Yeah, this is halfway full, pretty much. I gotta come back with a garbage bag. Sorry about that ass shot there. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I appreciate everything you guys do, and uh, that's commenting, sharing, liking, everything. I really appreciate it. The more the merrier like the shit out of it every video you see hit that thumbs up that helps us every video you see if you like it share it with your friends your family because that helps us too and as well as your comments let us know what you think uh, you have any ideas you want things you want us to do you have questions for us ask us um, you name it we're, we're pretty much an open book I don't hide nothing. I'm real. I am who I am. And if you don't like me, well, I got an itch. So uh, that's all I could say. <laughs> On that note, uh, don't forget to watch our other videos if you haven't seen them. The very first video we did is the banger. I will say that. Um, we have another banger of the 200-pound propane tank we found. The Remington shotgun we found, the axe head, many, many more. Over 200 videos. Go check those out. Make sure to subscribe and help us. 500 gets us halfway there. We need to still hit that thousand. And um, don't forget to follow us also on TikTok and Instagram, Facebook Reels. And we're going to catch you on the next one. So, on that note, keep smiling. <laughs> and we'll catch you on the next one.